Okay, Virgo, I was doing your reading and then I got interrupted, but I'm going to let you know the one that you held close to you as a friend is the one that's now betraying you. There's a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio that is talking about you and it's crazy because when I pick up on Virgo's energy, always remember there's good and bad people, okay? So whatever bad Virgo that is watching me, watching me and see I'm telling the truth, your friend betrayed you. So, this reading is for Virgo for the month of September, year 2023. Please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Hit the like button, share, and subscribe. This is a general reading. Ooh, it's because of the things that you invested in with this person in the past. Allah, please send Virgo 200 angels to stand, guard, guide, and protect. I'm hearing and expose. Allah, please send me 200 angels to stand, guard, guide, and protect me as I open this portal. I do not partner you with my divination, but I ask of you to guide me through so that my readings can be truthful, accurate, and honest. Please show me Virgo's current energy. What I tell you is what you invested in. With the seven of pentacles here. Now all what you invested in. You got a little bit back. <laughs> Allah show me. This Virgo that I'm picking up. The seven of pentacles. Why is this here for Virgo? The cycle period in the years that you had invested. Okay, there's going to be some changes. Some changes is happening. Look at this. In the tower. Eight of swords. Restricted. Now you're restricted. You and everybody else involved is, re in, is restricted in this tower. So please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. This is not for all Virgos. Allah, show me. What did this Virgo had a cycle, a cycle period of investing, restricting others to the tower? This is the main reason why some things is happening in your life, Virgo. Whoa. The Seven of Swords. I told you. Your friend group, Ace of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, is being sneaky. You're being exposed by people that's out there in your circle. Seven of Swords is someone packing up, leaving, trying to gain balance. Two of Swords, this could be you and children being left behind. This is also being sneaky, deceptive, giving information, whether it's truthful or false. There's, there's gossip about you within that Eight of Cups. Yep, the devil, okay? This is what you put out. You're getting right back in. Could be a Capricorn involved or not. This is the greedy people. The greedy people that you connect with. Okay. The karmic group within the Ace of Cups. Show me the devil. When you got the devil, this is greedy, materialistic. This is being a, a, a aggressive and possessive and spying and lying. Okay. This is Three of Swords energy, third party energy within that Ace of Cups, where it's the Seven of Swords, where it's sneaky behavior. Three of Swords, somebody afflicted a lot of pain being in this devil energy right here. Somebody has to hold accountability. This is why everybody else is being sat down, okay? There was an offer that was made and was rejected. Four of Cups is what's in that Ace of Cups right there. Somebody was a bully, an emperor in reverse, could be a child's father. This person don't take care of their kids. They don't take care of their children. They don't stick up for their children. Okay, somebody is being aggressive here. An aggressive bully. 
so there was a time period where some Virgos was being aggressive bullies. This is what they had invested in, bringing people towers, trying to restrict them and, tra and trap them. Now, it's out there and it opened the Ace of Cups and the Seven of Swords to the devil. There's uh, sexual perversities, there's substance abuse, okay? There's lust, there's, there's, there's a lot of uh, betrayal here. Show me more for this Virgo. Thank you, Allah. Four of Wands, this is the home, this is the foundation. This is what's going on. Ooh. Somebody is saying, somebody is, see, God did step in. Okay, God stepped in, and there's the Nine of Swords here. This could be an ending of a marriage or a relationship. This is what's going on in the Four of Wands. All right, somebody is saying that you worship the devil, that the devil is your God. Yes, indeed. So this is um, public humiliation, okay? So Allah Ahmad Hill will give you the highest degree of uh, public humiliation. Yep, so God does have a hand in it. And what goes around comes around. Allah, show me what you're doing to this Virgo who is now stressed out in the Nine of Swords because the past is catching up. Okay. Mm-hmm. Wounding. 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 Arguments, fights, and nuisances. Um within the four of wands justice is being served here a libra could be involved if not this is the justice being served somebody is getting depressed here okay because of what they chose to manifest what they chose to manifest in the seven of pentacles and you ain't getting nothing back you're getting back what you put out that's about it so this is the closing conclusion to these bad virgos here show me thank you allah we got the Queen of Wands here. Okay. Why is this Queen of Wands been coming out in, in Virgo's reading? This Queen of Wands is successful. Leave this Queen of Wands alone. How many times must people have to be told to leave this fire sign alone? You tried to cause an ending to this Queen of Wands here. Death ending. This Queen of Wands had went through a rebirth. Okay? A complete rebirth. So this is some jealousy and envy that God's seen. The possession. The, the obsession with this Queen of Wands. This Queen of Wands always comes out with the Six of Wands. Now, don't get me wrong. You can have fire in your chart. But this Queen of Wands always comes out with the Six of Wands. And then the Virgos that watch me say, I don't know. The Leo did it. But when Allah shows me that this Queen of Wands is minding his or her business. Okay? It lets me know when people tell me that they're really trying to force this reading and it doesn't even fit okay so that's their delusion but this queen of wands always comes out successfully why does this queen of wands always come out successfully in a virgo reading what's up with this virgo and this devil energy this is the truth that i'm speaking now y'all could switch it around and do whatever that's that like i said people like to force things but i'm speaking the truth this Queen of Wands is a very truthful person and focus on one's success. This is why people are now talking about this Virgo that is within the Ace of Cups, the friend group. This Queen of Cups, I told you that Cancer Pisces Scorpio, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, man, betrayed you, Virgo. Show me, yeah. Show me what this Queen of Cups is now doing to Virgo. And this Queen of Cups, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, was very close to this Virgo. Look at this. Five of Swords causing conflict, causing arguments, jealousy, envy. That Queen of Cups is now talking about you. What is this Queen of Cups saying? You ain't got no money. This Queen of Cups is broke too. See, they, you guys work together and now it's all coming apart. This is a message that somebody was waiting for me to give. And also this Queen of Cups 
is giving out information about you. Why? You can look at that. Eight of Wands, the communication, not missing an opportunity. Yeah. So if you did any witchcraft with this Queen of Cups, it's now being blamed on you. And this Queen of Cups was also putting witchcraft on you too. <laughs> yep. This Queen of Cups been lying and spying on you, gossiping about you, running off with the mouth about you what else was this queen of cups saying about this virgo what was okay that you don't have no vision ain't no ships coming in you don't have no high contacts nothing is coming towards you so why is did this queen of cups switch up on this virgo oh shit Why did this Queen of Cups switch up on this Virgo? The sun? Why is the sun here? This this Queen of Cups is exposing you now. Yup. This Queen of Cups told someone that you was juggling judgment this queen of cups told someone that possibly you were in a relationship with that you were cheating juggling juggling a relationship see going into this house someone was making an offer so this cancer went and start communicating to your person that you was making offers in the background while your person was in a back shelf okay that brought burdens that was burdens in the betrayal baby yeah that's a big old fight right there the five of wands the ten of swords and the ten of wands this yeah your friend turned on you mm-hmm show me more Allah uh-huh we got the king of pentacles king of pentacles the king of pentacles Taurus Virgo Capricorn came rushing in extremely fast this is why this Queen of Cups is doing this. Because the Queen of Cups has always had an affair with the King of Pentacles. Okay? The King of Pentacles is actually not a boyfriend, not a girlfriend, but a sibling of yours. So this Queen of Cups is dating a family member. Ooh. Yeah, this King of Pentacles was having a relationship with, with the Queen of Cups. And something ended with the death. So this King of Pentacles went rushing in angrily. This King of Pentacles didn't walk away to find happiness nowhere. This King of Pentacles was not happy with this Queen of Cups. So where this King of Pentacles walked off to, possibly someplace in the past, okay? Because the devil energy is, is definitely getting, this is past energy, past people. This King of Pentacles walked away towards unhappiness, where there's no jobs, where there's no love, okay? No opportunity, behind it i told you offer to the family yes baby so this king of pentacles gotta be the virgo's brother that's dating the queen of cups that took an offer due to family and finances thought that there was gonna be great changes so what happened between this king of pentacles and this queen of cups the reason why this queen of cups is now betraying the virgo Money. Money. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? Oh. <laughs> so the Queen of Cups and the Virgo is bums.
without this king of pentacles finances the virgo and the queen of cups is homeless unemployed no money loss of weight gaining weight okay yeah so there's there's codependency here so this king of pentacles yep here you are we got the king of pentacles and we got the queen of pentacles this is a virgo reading okay this is the king of pentacles here so what happened between the king of the king of pentacles and the queen of cups who is actually using the king of pentacles knight of pentacles two of cups so this king of pentacles was perpetrating to be someone that's stable someone that's traditional Queen of Cups has been in the family and dealing with this King of Pentacles even while this King of Pentacles was married to the Queen of Wands. This is this is brother and sister I'm picking up. The brother and sister actually lived together in the same house where there's a whole bunch of deception. So the king of pentacles, when they fight with the queen of cups, the king of pentacles goes back to the Virgo. See, all this was over the king of pentacles money. Everybody's a bully here. Ten of pentacles is investments, yes, but it's also family. So this queen of pentacles and this king of pentacles is family. So what happened? Oh, snap. So there's no true love here. There's no there's no true love here. This is all manipulation. This queen of wands successfully seen the truth in the games and, and moved along. So with lovers in reverse, also someone likes the same sex. Okay, could be the Virgo that likes the same sex. It could be the Cancer that likes the same sex. It could be the Capricorn, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn with the King of Pentacles that likes the same sex. But when you have love in reverse, there's a betrayal here and someone's unable to forgive another. There's interference and in in-laws and outside people. So what makes these people think that their relationships are going to be happy and go lucky if they broke up a marriage and the king of pentacles was down for the breakup with the, the successful queen of wands who sees the truth this is nothing but manipulation here so without the king of pentacles the queen of cups will be homeless the queen of cups will have losses okay so without the king of pentacles to the to the sister which is the virgo okay which is family ties what's gonna happen the innocence is lost within this brother and sisterhood okay so there's incest involved within this brother and sister this is why the king of pentacles always go back to the queen of pentacles this is family the innocence is lost yep the brother and sisters are incest this queen of pentacles and this king of pentacles that sometimes come out in readings is family members. So there could be brother and sister here that got the same mother and different daddy or got the, the same daddy and different mother. They're in love. They will never ever break ties. Okay? Their innocence is lost. It was lost in a crowded marketplace. They played a game in the world with this queen of cups for keeps. Okay? And everybody is greedy. So this queen of 
this queen of cups is upset with the virgo and the king of pentacles because the king of pentacles doesn't love this uh cancer here because the cancer pisces scorpio is a player all this was orchestrated together with the three of pentacles these people work together okay even the brother and sister incest line this is how they can work together okay we got the temperance here why is the temperance here this king of pentacles went and uh started working with these people and it was all an illusion these people, the Virgo that I'm picking up, the King of Pentacles, the Queen of Cups, they all created an illusion with this devil energy here. And they were trying to shift that negative energy onto this Queen of Wands who was successfully over here and minded one's business. This Queen of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, and the Queen of Cups is not protected. Now, because they were trying to hold back finances somebody's holding back some finances here we got the moon here and we got the devil and the magician and the illusion okay show me more of why this queen of cups oh oh because the virgo this virgo lied to the king of wands sagittarius leo aries sagittarius energy so this queen of cups is trying to block this relationship with the queen of wands due to what the king of pentacles had did to the queen of wands now it's all being played out by that cancer which has always been the king of pentacles mistress nobody's happy nine of cups is in reverse there's no motivation, there's no inspiration, there's no passions, there's no warm, loving family life, there's no fertility assured. <clears throat> but somebody told this king of wands that this queen of pentacles, this Virgo was over here screwing. <laughs> and this king of wands could be what was locked up or who was locked up with the eight of swords and the justice card. That's legal issues, that's jail time. So somebody was in jail and they got out. When they got out, the, the Queen of Cups started to gossip about the Virgo and tell people within the Ace of Cups that this Queen of Pentacles, God is the devil, and that they practice witchcraft and cause illusions. Woo. So there's no there's no hopes, there's no inspirations and dreams, there's no healing. What's the outcome? Everybody's stupid. They stupid. Everybody that did this is stupid, okay? The queen of swords in reverse is somebody that's not organized, somebody that's not logical, somebody's not analytical, okay? Somebody has no morals, they have no standards, they have no clarity. This is because the illusion that they caused on other people to cipher their positive energy and break up relationships is now happening. So Virgo, this is for the bad Virgo. If you were sitting there talking bad, talking down on this queen of wands, okay is now being done to you if you broke up a marriage and brought this queen of cups back to the king of pentacles during a marriage then your relationships is going to fall people are now talking about you and gossiping about you wow show me more thank you allah You got this high priestess here. This queen of cups knows things. <laughs> knows things. So why everybody else is overreacting, this queen of cups here has dirt on you. And this queen of cups unleashed the dirt. Okay? Because this queen of cups knows that you're not strong. They know that you have a weak character. This queen of cups got everybody involved has a weak character. Okay? Everybody involved has a weak character. Nobody is strong. Somebody thought they was going to move calmly to the Ace of Pentacles. Somebody thought that they were going to get handed a blessing. King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And the Empress here. Oh. So, people are looking at this Queen of Wands 
successfully as an empress who could be with the king of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and they're getting blessings and they're being talked about with the Ten of Cups. So somebody is saying, yeah, since this Queen of Wands had had um, the King of Pentacles out of his or her life, they've been happy, they've been successful, they've been balanced on a new phase. So somebody is laying there thinking about it. This is their karma. This is your karma. This is your karma to watch this Queen of Wands or this King of Swords receive blessings and move forward successfully. Boom. There it is. So that's karma. That's it. That's karma. You can't do dirt with people. <laughs> okay? You cannot do dirt with people thinking that they're going to be loyal to you. You cannot do anything to harm anyone else because you got a free will or someone is jealous, okay? And you ended relationships, you used that black magic over there, and if you did it as an occult and you turned against each other, then that's karma. This is karmic justice. So let's see more. This queen of cups is a player, his or herself. This is, this is a big backfire Allah show me more what do people think about this Virgo since this Cancer Pisces Scorpio is spilling the beans what does the community think about this Virgo now that the the uh Cancer Pisces Scorpio is 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 uh, telling. Wow, the tower, the tower. Wow, you got death here to the Ten of Swords, to the Ace of Cups. The friendships is over. The friendships is stopping. Yes, indeed. There's death to the Ace of Cups behind the betrayal. Now it's stopping. Things are slowing down. Show me more of this Cancer Pisces Scorpio who is telling on this Virgo and the King of uh, Pentacles. Who is this Cancer Pisces Scorpio talking to about the Virgo and the King of Pentacles? being dragged everybody that y'all know everybody that y'all know is talking about it everybody that you worked with is talking about it this is your judgment Allah Adbar Hill is bringing public humiliation shame and dishonor Allah Al Hasib is the name of God for judgment You got the Nine of Cups in reverse. Ooh. People are talking about who you was having relationships with. Talking about the family. Talking about this King of Pentacles. Just talking. Ooh. This is the Ten of Wands and the Burdens. Ooh, bad reputation. King of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. The feelings are caught up in this illusion, the Seven of Cups. Everybody's feelings is all over the place. 
This is what was manifested here with the moon. You got this empress over here successfully once again. What the hell? Why is they so... Oh, somebody, somebody is saying that you... Yo, did, okay. So everybody that you did witchcraft with, everybody you 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 had encounters with, it's it's caught up in that illusion. Everybody is being talked about now, okay? Everybody's being talked about. This is karma. This whole occult here, this whole group, okay, who caused some type of illusion. Their emotions is all over the place. This King of Cups is like, oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking. Like, this is just the energy of it. I wasn't thinking. I didn't know that she was going to do that. I didn't know that he was going to do that. <laughs> oh, snap. This guy, somebody took a leap of faith and went back to the past and went into a tower. <laughs> Everybody's talking. Everybody was talking about this Queen of Wands marriage. Yes, indeed. This is the truth. Everybody was, had something to say about this Queen of Wands. Everybody had something to say about this Queen of Wands. They had something to say about this Queen of Wands religion. They had something to say about her or his higher education. They had something to say that because... This Queen of Wands is responsible and does what's supposed to do. Everybody is talking about how this Queen of Wands is connected to God, okay? There's some Queen of Wands that is very, very faithful to God. And people are talking about this one. And they're saying that this Queen of Wands is <laughs> successful, is the Empress here that kept working, kept going. So, therefore, people are talking about this this king of pentacles like they're stupid like how could you how could you leave this empress here how could you do that you were married to a winner oh my gosh now how is this king of pentacles feeling this is the truth when i'm speaking justice is being stirred the scales is being balanced out so how is this king of pentacles feeling now wounded Yes, indeed, wounded. Even if you wasn't married to this, this king of pentacles here, you were still in a relationship with this person that was common law. And now this king of pentacles is looking at this queen of wands as the empress that's successful, that is marriage material. And now they have to sit and look in this queen of cups face. <laughs> Yo, and this is how that king of pentacles feels when... They have to look at this Queen of Cups. <laughs> they took a bad offer and they can't get out. There's no place for this King of Pentacles to go. <laughs> They're stuck. They're stuck in a bad investment. Yep, God said you, that this king of pentacles had rejected the offer of focus on those three cups. Now everybody's turning on each other with conflict. Real fast. Real fast. Ooh it was all for the money. <coughs> Ooh, you got the high priestess in reverse. Okay, so... When you got the high priestess in reverse, this is a man or a woman that brings destruction to a relationship, okay? Somebody that's not clean, somebody that's over-opinionated, judgmental, always got something to say, but it doesn't make any sense. You understand? Somebody that's not intuitive, somebody that's not calm. This queen of cups, this um, king of pentacles, and this uh, queen of pentacles here, this is a Virgo reading, um, ain't calm. They just rush in. Be oh, nothing's working out. Nothing is growing. These people are imposters. They're quitters. Okay, they talk about people. They tell white lies. They slander. They pretend to like someone, and then after they slay them behind their back. So this is what you have done, bad Virgo, and now it's being done to you. None of you are protected. Okay, God had unleashed the wrath. And when God's wrath is unleashed, you all are in spiritual jail. 
you all are in you're being restricted you're being forced into live in this conflict okay and it's behind the decisions yep so what's the outcome for this leo what's the outcome for this leo moving to calmer waters being independent self-efficient self-sufficient being abundant here you got the m she she or he is the emperor or the empress twice this is this is the empress twice okay moving to calmer waters oh yeah that queen of wands and this whoever is with this queen of wands queen of wands could be with a king of swords but could just be that intuitive okay is has hopes inspirations and dreams and stable and this didn't yeah oh look i said the king of swords here i said the king of swords libra gemini aquarius okay so this queen of wands is in self-love self-sufficient through god arachman arahim has given this queen of wands the four of wands and hopes, inspirations, and dreams and healing. This queen of wands is in a loving relationship that is very strong. Even if this queen of wands is single, this queen of wands is self-sufficient, independent, stable, clear, intuitive. Okay? Very strong. Y'all tried to block that queen of wands light. <laughs> it didn't work. So now y'all got to sleep in the Ten of Swords. You have to sleep in the betrayal within the Ace of Cups, which is now poisonous, has always been poisonous. Let me rephrase that. It has always been poisonous because your friends and your family is betraying you just as you betrayed others. Sneaky sons of our bitches. Look at this. Queen of Pentacles, Seven of, of Swords, and the Six of Cups. That queen of cups told your person, whoever that you was with, like I said, they could have got out of jail, okay? Or they're just being restricted. This queen of cups is saying that, yeah, Virgo was creeping over here. <laughs> okay? Yep. This cancer went and told that you was giving offers someone else while this person was back here. So the Queen of Cups went and told your person, okay, that you was getting and giving offers to someone else while they were here. So what goes around comes around. Now that Queen, the uh, King of Wands or Leo Aries Sagittarius, whoever this is, now nobody want to mess with you. Nobody wants to mess with you. I kept saying that in readings. Yeah, look, King of Wands came out, and I said that when I seen the Ace of Wands in reverse. This King of Wands, Sagittarius, doesn't have to be. Could be a Leo Aries, Sagittarius. Don't want to mess with you. Don't want a relationship with you. Don't want to have sex with you. Does not want you, okay? Wants to pack up and leave the children and you behind due to your sneaky behavior. Also being, being told that you was a witch. That you, your God is the devil? That you worship witchcraft? Yeah, your person know about that. Yeah, that queen of cups is running thy mouth, okay? Being a bully, being deceptive, being narcissistic, destroying relationships. Three of swords here. And people were happy in their relationships. People were happy in the ten of cups. And you caused this by doing that witchcraft? Thinking that there was going to be great changes for you? Nope. Success is in reverse. People are going to be turning their back. Okay. This is karma. God sent an angel to bring karma. This was a message that somebody was waiting for. Searching for a player. Searching for a player. Yeah. Going out, partying together, all that type of stuff. Flirting with other people. You got searching for the Knight of Wands to the Two of Cups. Yeah. Yep. Your friend. That's why everybody's in the Five of Cups energy. You got the Six of Pentacles in reverse. That was causing imbalances in other people's finances. Now you're going through it. So there's going to be a cycle period where things is going to slow down. 
okay and there's gonna be there's gonna be a death somebody can even pass away from this black magic this witchcraft but there's definitely gonna be um an ending endings okay that's that's rough virgo that's rough but you better leave that queen of wands alone because that queen of wands all right you kept messing with that queen of wands kept spying on that queen of wands kept talking about that queen of wands kept lying and this is why this is happening because that queen of wands comes out with god with the power of god you don't know somebody else's spiritual ranking and you're trying to kill them kill their life okay with witchcraft this is the truth what i'm telling you so what's the outcome to Virgo, the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and this Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio? What's the outcome? Devil upright. Three of wands. Four of wands. Four of wands, four of pentacles in reverse, and the chariot is in reverse. So something's being released. Something's not being held back, but you still can't move forward. Okay, so what's coming towards you? All right, and it's not gonna stop, it's not gonna go like forward. It's gonna literally be stuck. You're gonna be stuck in a devil energy. You're gonna be stuck in that devil energy for as many years as you and these people was practicing witchcraft. God's not gonna let you go. Okay, Allah Dair is going to cause you harm, affliction, and distress and bring endings into your life. So you're getting back what you pulled out. You're getting back what you put out. And I don't feel bad for you because if you got this much time on your hands to destroy other people's life with black magic, then this was a long time coming. The little current events that you had with your karma is not going to compare to this because there's going to be an ending. So the wrath of God has been released upon you.